this video I'm going to show you guys how to use the audio modules which this is the actual template demo and these are the audio modules here and I'm going to show you on the demo that I've set up how to set them up exactly like this. So the first thing that you are going to want to do is set up a specialty section. Uh, I chose one like this because this is going to be a sidebar automatically put in and then you can choose your module layout position so then you can choose to have one and then these two. So the reason why I chose a specialty section is with this one you can only do one column. You can't add multiple rows. Uh, if you do it adds a row underneath and if you have a sidebar it adds it all the way at the bottom of that sidebar even if there's no content under this one because this is your columns so we want to go ahead and get rid of that one uh, we want to insert columns I'm gonna do one like this then add a row and one like this and then our modules of course this is just going to be the sidebar so I'm just gonna set this up quickly and then we're going to insert our modules, the audio module. And you can add a URL manually, but I'm just gonna go to the upload because I have my audio files in here and I can just click it and it will automatically put that URL in. And then I'm going to give it a title, artist name, and album name. Then I'm going to go ahead and get a cover image, which I'll just go ahead and use this one right here. And then I am going to, I can select a color as well right here. Uh, if you want to change a color, this is just the one I have in my default template. You can come into the color and you can mess around with this or you can put a hexadermal code in here from the internet and you can get the exact color that you want for your background. Then there's the text color, light or dark. Uh, you want the text black or you want the text white, depending on your background. And then everything's in, so then we're just gonna hit save and preview. So then it put that one in there, right there like that, as you can see. Now we're going to go to these ones down here and add audio just going to use this same one again for the demo title artist name and then of course grab a new cover art image for this audio file and save and then one more over here and go ahead and put a title artist name and album name preview and then you see that's why I chose that specialty section because now we can get a layout like this versus the other one which can only go one section one section one section it wouldn't be able to lay out like this like the specialty sections And then, of course, you can have with an image or without an image. But now you see we have the title by artist name, album name. 
and you can put an entire album in but this will play entire album in this one section i don't believe that they have it set up to do one song one song one song one song if you were to put in a full track of 12 songs in one but anyway now you see how that works and how you can simply add the cover art image and how you can simply get the audio and then I will quickly demo this for you guys so at this point you may want to turn your speakers down if you have them up loud because this is very loud and I'm going to show you quickly how this works and now you see that it is counting down the little bubble here is moving and that this works And then of course these ones down here will work too. So now you can see that you can kind of take something like this and you could set up a music page, which is pretty cool. And this is built into the template, it's one of the modules, so it doesn't require an extra plugin or component. 